Hey Aquarius, this is Soul, uh, Intuitive Tarot for Unique Souls. Welcome to my channel. Aquarius, this is going to be your general focus reading for the week of April 11th through the 17th, 2016. All right, Aquarius, let's get right into your reading. Uh, for some Aquarians that I'm reading for, you have the potential of dealing with the energy of the High Priest, Major Arcana, Major Life Event. The High Priest is showing up uh, in the reverse for uh, you Aquarius this week and the one of the messages that I'm getting right off the top is either it's you or someone that's close or significant to you is turning their back on religion or they're having difficulty uh, expressing um, some sort of beliefs in religion okay or they're questioning their beliefs in religion the hierophant shows up I'm sorry I said the hierophant is the high priest the high priest shows up in the reverse also to give me a, a message to pass on to you that some of you, um, there's a postponement of a wedding or a delay in a wedding. The marriage is not, well, the wedding is not taking place. So it's either a postponement or it was an postponement or a delay. And someone getting married. Now, if it's not you directly, it's someone that you're close or significant to. So it could involve that, you know, wedding invites went out. Now you might receive this upcoming week that has been postponed or delayed or called off altogether. Also, with the high priest showing up in the reverse, I'm getting that some Aquarians that I'm reading uh, for who are doing continued um education higher learning or something they're having difficulty with a subject matter now this could be online or this could be um directly involving an institution someone's having difficulties with studies okay it's uh, whatever that subject matter is it's giving them a hard time uh, also too is the whole emphasis on uh relationships as well so it could be that um you know this um high priest is showing up in the reverse that there could be some sort of not really conflicts there may be some sort of disagreements uh with partnerships this week too for some aquarians that i'm reading for uh but i definitely see that there's a, a wedding that has been called off or a postponement or a delay um someone's having problems with uh higher uh education in terms of their studies or you know a subject matter either online or in their direct institution and then there's this whole uh, question of religion. Someone's uh, questioning their beliefs in terms of the religion. If it's not the Aquarius, then it's someone that they're close or significant to. Reason passed. Yesterday going back to, uh, oh, by the way, too, it could be related to a earth sign individual since the high priest represents Taurus. It could be also a Capricorn or Virgo male or female. Something going on with someone questioning their beliefs in terms of the religion and someone turning their back on religion. Uh, now we have yesterday going back to two weeks since this is a mini read Aquarius, we have the page of swords in the reverse. So some kind of decision uh, came quickly to some Aquarians uh, within the past two weeks. Um, because this is a general reading, you have to apply the message to whatever is close or significant to you. Uh, so if it's a relationship, uh, friendship, something to do with having to make a quick, you know, decision about, um, you know, children, job, what have you, uh, being in the reverse, that means you, it came quickly, but you still were undecided. That particular situation brought on some conflict, a little bit of anxiety, uh, but because it's in the passing and we're moving forward, there's a decision that still needs to be made. It's an important decision, uh, but it's something that came to the Aquarius that I'm reading for or Aquarians that I'm reading for quickly. OK, in the middle of the week, we have the star card. Star card is definitely representative of Aquarius. So this is you. It's in the reverse major arcana, major life event. So there's a situation that I am seeing uh, related to some Aquarians possibly going into the middle of the week and feeling scattered. It may be related to something that came to you quickly two weeks ago in terms of making the decision and you have yet to make that decision. The star card also represents uh, social media for me so that there is a situation where some of you are possibly uh, communicating 
through social media venues, you know, Instagram, Facebook, uh, you know, online dating. Uh, the star card is anything that you wish for or hope for, it will be granted to you. But there's some sort of delay uh, with whatever it is that you want to come your way. It's some sort of temporary delay. It's still forthcoming, but it's a delay. All right. And then the stars represent being scattered. So some of you may be feeling scattered based on having to make a decision uh, that was brought to you quickly with the page of swords showing up in the past uh, two weeks. It's passing you. All right. By the tail end of the week, we now have um, the four wands in the upright position. So I do feel that whatever is going on with some Aquarians, you will by the end of the week feel um, <clears throat> in a better place. You know, the four of wands is all about a family life and happy home. And, um, you know, there's a lot of love generated there, you know, either with children or significant others. It doesn't matter. I just feel that whatever takes a toll on you possibly this week, um, by the end of the week, it's like, you know, some of you may see the house or where you stay as a retreat, um, but you will be um you know happy to be around family and friends in the home environment also too there's a situation where some aries um forgive me please some aquarius is possibly um looking to relocate move to another area move to another home apartment purchase a home with this four of wands showing up. Some of you are in relationships or dating. Fire sign energies. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, male or female. And if that's the case, it's uh, that union is bringing a lot of uh, happiness. Especially in the home. And there could be some issues related to um, mechanical stuff going on inside the home as well. Okay, nothing to worry about, uh, you know, if you're a homeowner, if you even if you're not a homeowner, there's just an issue going on that I feel that some of you have to contend with going into the weekend. But overall, it's not really a bad uh, reading uh, for some Aquarius. So just somebody is coming. I think that it's uh, related to this religion, turning your back or, you know, questioning your religious beliefs or questioning the beliefs of someone else who's religious is coming into play because I'm getting a lot of spiritual emphasis here with this card showing up. Um, so other than that, it's having to make a decision that you haven't arrived in making that's creating some sort of scattered energy possibly for you in the middle of the week. Okay. And... Whatever you wish for, hope for, it still will be granted. But it may be delayed. All right, so the energy of Oracle card that I have selected um, for you, Aquarius, is, see, this is so appropriate for the reading I just did. We have now indecision. And the indecision card is all about having to make a decision about taking that right turn or that left turn. And here we have Little Red Riding Hood. And it's like, oh my, which direction should I go? So I'm going to relate that to the page of swords that's showing up in the reverse that possibly some decision that came to you quickly and you have not yet made that decision. And you're still at this particular time ambivalent about making the decision. Left turn, right turn. Which way do I go? Okay. But it's uh, totally up to you. Um, if you're indecisive at this time, um, <clears throat> You know, give yourself some more time before you make a final decision, okay? Because whatever you decide on, um, depending on the importance, the emphasis of the importance to you, uh, it could affect you um, later on. So choose wisely, Aquarius. That's your reading for this uh, upcoming week. Once again, I want to thank you for visiting my channel. I do want to wish you all a very safe upcoming week ahead. Until the next time, Aquarius, uh, I wish you love and light. Take care. Bye.